<laughs> Hi there. Uh, I'm in bed with Evelyn Troll today. Hi. Hi. Nice to meet you. Uh, I have some questions for you. Okay. And uh, I'm excited for your answers. And first, I'd like to know what happened last night. Uh, we played a show in. What's its face? Um, <laughs> I just forgot the city, but it was. It was a bit lame. There weren't many people, and then the promoter got angry because we wanted to play another song. And then he started a fight with our sound uh, girl, Rebecca, and she um, um, told him to fuck off. And then <laughs> we stopped playing on stage, and we stopped playing and packed up and went away. Now you're here. Yeah. That's, you'll that's be here what tonight, happened. right? Yeah, we're so, playing. Yeah. It'll be hopefully a good gig today. Mm -hmm. So, um, when you write your songs, or did one of your songs get ever come out of a dream? It did actually. Okay. Uh, actually, my last album, well, uh, it, part of it came from a dream, and it's the dream where I'm in the airport and I get attacked by an Indian tribe, and they shoot me in the head with an arrow, okay. and then I don't die. The arrow stays in my head, but I have to get it. Um, I have to break kind of break the end off. And put makeup on because I have a show, so I have to go to the show with the arrow in my head, and it's oh, really it sounds like a like a bad nightmare. Yeah, it's not a nice feeling. So yeah, that's that's basically the story of Arrowhead, which is my last album. Yeah. Okay, interesting. <laughs> <laughs> um, did you ever have a little light on when you fell asleep as a kid, or did you ever need the light to fall asleep in your room? No, I needed different things. Like I needed my parents to maybe sing a little song and then they would do this thing where they took the blanket and made a little, put it under your feet and then they call it a foot house. Oh. And as soon as the foot house is in place, I can sleep or I could sleep. Interesting. Yeah. And nowadays I just um, think of cuddles and then I fall asleep. Oh. That's cute. It kind of also fits for the next question. Can you fall asleep when you had a fight with someone you love? No. No. I don't think so. It's been a long time, though. <laughs> so you don't fight? I don't love. <laughs> you don't love? Okay. <laughs> um, did, did something bad ever happen to you because you overslept? Or because someone else overslept, the bandmate or someone? I've missed a few flights, but it's not the worst. It's not the end of the world. You just kind of take it as it is. <laughs> That's the way to live by. Yeah. I like that. Yeah. There's going to be a next flight, you know. <laughs> yeah, great. Um, if an album could become a person, like the album itself, every album, you can think whatever you want, um, which album would you like to have sex with? Ooh. Probably, I don't know how to pronounce it, but the tricky album, the red one, Max and Kling Kling, something. That's a really sexy album. You know the one? I, I think I know. He recorded it with his then lover wife, and she, her singing is amazing, and the beats are really, okay. really sexy. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that or uh, Iggy Pop, The Idiot. Oh, okay. That's very sexy, I think. Okay. I see. Um... Who would you invite to a pajama party or like a sleepover? Uh, my band. <laughs> we do well, we do sleep in a room together, so it's kind of already happening. And maybe yeah, who else? Like Ed Kendrick Lamar. Okay. I would want to cuddle with him. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, this is our last question, but um, which monster sleeps under your bed? Hmm. I don't know. Nah. The monster sleeps in my bed with me. Oh. Yeah. Not under, but in. In my bed, yeah. You have to confront your monsters all the time. Okay. That's interesting. <laughs> <laughs> Could you describe the monster, or is it just there? It's there. It's fluffy. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> so at least you always have a cuddle buddy. Yeah. <laughs> Okay, that's sadly the end. It was so much fun. Thank you so much for Thanks. talking to me. And uh, we'll see you next time. Bye. Bye. <laughs>